Hey, what's up guys? Tomcat here, and today I'm bringing you some footage from my open lobby that ju literally just happened. Um, it was awesome. Uh, we had an amazing turnout. We played a bunch of, uh, we did a little bit of drifting, but we played a bunch of infected, and it was just a ton of fun. Uh, I believe I start out as the infected, as the zombie, uh, in this match. I'm obviously in a matte black Aventador, and because of my all-wheel drive, I just take off and nail this, uh, CLK GTR, and then of course that Zonda comes up, hits me, not realizing I'm the zombie, and gets tagged. So, and obviously come back here, bam, right into the Subaru, just absolutely take him out, spin around, all-wheel drive, launching the other way, just going after the, uh, going after the other people like crazy. Um, now, uh, something I did want to talk about, uh, before that, that bit of the gameplay starts, is, um, the actual time that this match was because a lot of people made the mistake of sending uh, their messages to invite for me to invite them an hour late so the lobby happened at 10 p.m. Eastern US time and a lot of people sent the oh my god that was insane that was crazy uh, anyway a bunch of people sent the message to invite for me to invite them at 11 p.m. Eastern U.S. time instead of 10 p.m. Eastern U.S. time. So, if you guys that are in different time zones, the you just I'm serious. Go on Google and look up a time zone converter. They are all over the internet. They're easy to find, and it will just save you so much time, and it'll help you get into my lobbies because, I mean, do you guys seriously want me to invite you if it's you know? if there's like ol only five minutes left of the lobby you know what I mean if we're on the last race I there's really you know I can't really invite any more people uh, to the match because it won't um, it just won't be as much fun for you and, the, and the, at that point the lobby is winding down so if you guys really 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 um, me remember to go check out those time zone converters look them up on Google and just find a good one and convert it from whatever your time zone is to Eastern US time and you will get the time for my open lobbies now if I'm correct the West Coast is three hours behind so you can uh, you can base it off of that you can measure it off of that if you uh, if you're in the on the West Coast uh, and then it just goes you know two hours behind one hour behind as you get closer you know um, I'm getting mountain time central time uh, yeah, Mountain Time, Central Time, and Eastern Time, uh, which at Eastern Time is mine. Now, for this round of Infected, I am in this, uh, red Koenigsegg CC8S, and this car is actually a really underused car, because, I don't know, because people always go for the CCX or the Ajira, but the reason why I'm in this car specifically is, wow, <laughs> that was a fail, back bumper fell off and everything. Anyway, reason why I'm in this car is because... We had, um, there were, like, I did, I made some interesting restrictions in this, uh, in this lobby, so it was actually, uh, just to try to make it more interesting than your average, you know, conventional, um, uh, you know, infected lobby. So what we did was, we said, for this, for this round anyway, for the first round, it was R3, uh, dealer cars only. For the second round, it was S-Class, dealer cars only, so stock no modifications, no tuning, no garage cars, uh, everything uh, that everybody's running in this match is completely stock, and by the way, I had no idea that you could drive th just com straight through the pits without pitting uh, in infected mode, so that's pretty cool, I mean, if you want to save, you know, maybe use that to save, uh, save a replay and get some pictures actually in the pit, and that guy seriously just robbed that tag from me. I was going to tag that other guy in the Lambo, but the other zombie just literally robbed that tag from me. Look at that Aston spinning out like crazy. <laughs> that Aston was all over the freaking track. So, actually, I all, some of my new subscribers have been sending me... Have been... Uh, they've been sending me uh, messages over YouTube uh, that, have, you know, they've been asking me... How do I get into your open lobbies? What do I have to do? What message do I have to send? Uh, and I've got people on Xbox Live sending me chat invites, uh, messages, how do I get into your open lobbies? 
Now, and I know a lot. there have been a lot of new subscribers coming in. I had a huge surge in subscribers recently, so I know a lot of you are going to be new, so I'll just explain to you actually how to get in. So, at the time I say the open lobby is going to be, so say if it's 10 p.m. Eastern U.S. time, whatever that time is in your time zone, you're going to send me a message on Xbox Live saying invite me or INV or INV me. Whatever you want to do, just send a message to the gamer tag Tomcat9700. That is my Xbox Live gamer tag, and in order to get into my open lobbies, you need to send a message to that gamer tag saying invite me or INV or INV me or whatever whatever message you want to send, as long as it says something about an open lobby in it, I will invite you. And as long as the lobbies aren't full, uh, you you will um, you will be able to get in, and I try to get them as full as possible because, you know, big lobbies are usually the most fun. I thought I was going to go right between the middle right, right there, but it did not work out. It just did not work out at all. I mean, seriously, it did not work out at all. Oh, by the way, uh, a lot of people enjoyed that uh, double barrel roll in the FJ Cruiser that I uploaded from Forza Horizon. It's about like a 30 second or so clip, and I wonder if you guys would like me to upload more... Uh, clips like that, like just moments that have happened, like crazy moments uh, th just from when I'm randomly recording Forza. If you guys want me to, then I will definitely uh, start uploading those little clips for you guys. I mean, they're easy to get, and you know, it's just kind of like something that I think kind of gets you guys into the game more, because it kind of lets you know what I'm doing, because I can capture a 30 second, I can take that 30 second clip and render it and upload it almost instantly for you guys, so it's almost it's almost live. It's close to live, but uh, not completely live. And yes, I will start live streaming in the future, you know, possibly when I get a new capture card. So if you guys enjoyed that video, don't forget to click that like button. Tell me in the comment section below what you thought of it. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe for more videos.